Well, you guys are crazy. I cannot believe how well the first episode of this series did. You guys absolutely loved it. Thank you so much. And uh, let's get into it. This is part two of SpongeBob SquarePants Battle for Bikini Bottom Rehydrated. We are going to be back on the grind today, back looking for some shiny objects and back looking for those golden spatulas. So uh, let's get into it. I feel like our first episode was pretty productive. We actually unlocked 10 golden spatulas. I feel like we really kind of took our time and, and, you know, did as much as we could. And uh, we're going to be going to downtown Bikini Bottom to start things off today. We unlocked this at five golden spatulas. I think we can go to Goo Lagoon at 10. So we've already got that unlocked. And then downtown there's a third spot Bikini as well. Bottom. Let's go downtown. A bustling metropolis. Now a debris covered crater. A golden ship wheel up there. SpongeBob, the robots are destroying downtown Bikini Bottom. We have to evacuate. All right, but it's going to take a while to get all this dust. Not vacuum, evacuate. We have to get everyone to safety. Can we just load them up in the boats? That won't do any good. Why not? Because the robots have taken all the steering wheels. Ah. Couldn't we just drive in a straight line? No, there are too many turns. Those fiends, they thought of everything. Never fear, Mrs. Puff, I'll get those steering wheels back. SpongeBob, if you're involved, I always fear. But I tell you what, if you can pull this off, I'll give you a golden spatula. How about a driver's license instead? Nice try. Never gonna happen, SpongeBob. Good, good try though. All right. So our objective here is to collect the golden steering wheels. I'm curious, oh, we've got one out of 11. All right, so it looks like, uh, I mean, we should, I would imagine we can just grab that one there. Let's see what's going on with this. When SpongeBob touches this ball, he will change into a sponge ball. You can roll quickly as a sponge ball, but you cannot do anything else. Being hurt or pressing any button will change you back to your normal self. Interesting. What would we use that for, though? Honestly, I'm not sure. Let's go ahead and... Ooh, okay. Got an angry jellyfish over there. Um, I'm wondering if this is this is gonna open something up and then we're gonna be able to use the, the sponge ball. Let's open this up. Roll, ah, roll, roll the so we're able to get through. What is this? Oh, that is just rude. Let's go, Gary. <laughs> All right, let's see what's going on here. This robot is called a G-Love. The best way to deal with him is to bubble bounce him from above. All right. So we can roll up on him. Oh, yeah. Take him out, no problem at all. Let's go ahead and I feel like touch a new this sponge. guy real quick. You can see we've got Patrick Sock up there. We've got some other shiny things on the right. Gonna have to figure out how to get up top, but... For now, we're also kind of focusing on the steering. Ooh, look at all these. Might be able to end up getting up top. We've also got this guy here. I wonder if we jump up here. We can get up to this. I don't know where we'd go from here, though. Can we get to this? Nope. Looks like we've got some spilled hot sauces here. I'm not sure what to expect. Ooh. If we go quickly, we should be able to get to the other like side. Spring breeze. All right, got a checkpoint. I guess if you don't make it to the other side of these things, by the time the, the timer ends, it'll it'll like reset, I'm assuming. I have I have no idea. I feel like some a new, new unders here. Destroy all these things and let's see what we have in this area. Ooh. Okay, the hot sauce is bad for us. Probably could have guessed that. Got him. Beautiful. Fresh like a spring breeze. Here's our third, uh, our third steering wheel. Hmm. Looks like we can use this as a trampoline to be able to get up top here. Let's see where these go. Got a feeling there's gonna be something good up here. Maybe not. That's it. Thought we might have a route to get to, uh, get to another, what's it called? Another steering wheel. Okay. I guess let's keep going this way. First nautical bank is available here. We're going to be able to go inside and make a deposit. Let's go check it out. Nope, we can't go inside. All right. 
bringing it around town. What in the world? This thing is shooting canisters at me. I'm not quite sure what's going on. We got maximum underpants coverage, so that's always good. Take him out. We got some guys back here. Beautiful work. Take him out. We need some sort of a... An explosive... Ah! Uh, oh! I see what you're doing. Hold on. We're gonna go up. Nope. That doesn't work. I'm trying to get that explosive up there so it falls down and, and we can get it down here, but I guess... I guess we can't do that. Same thing here. Bringing it around town. Oops. Okay, that hurt a bit. We're gonna I be feel fine. like a new sponge. I'm gonna try going out this way. I'm not really sure. This is a new type of robot we haven't seen before. Looks like he's pretty easy to take down, though. What's up, little buddy? We're gonna figure out where our next main objective is. So that thing's firing off at us. Can we get it to hit? If we stand behind these things, will it hit them for us? Not quite. Let's see if we can get it. There it is. All right. Can you shoot shoot a little bit farther for me here? Got to stand behind it. Come on. Got to get close enough that it sees us. Oh, right on the money. Oh, shoot. It's still got us, though. Perfect. Ah, it looks like we're gonna have to hit. We're gonna have to hit all these buttons, huh? Fresh, like a spring Grab breeze. a new one of these. Let's go ahead and get set up like right, right here should be good. Get close enough that it'll shoot at us, but far enough away that it'll hit. Nice. And now we're gonna have one Too more. Can't take Staying it. kind of behind this guy. Oh, nope, we gotta back up a little bit. Need a little bit more arc. There it is. Okay. So we should be able to hit all these now. That's two. Oop. Sometimes that's pushing three. a simple button is the most satisfying. Put. And that's four. Took them down and. Looks like we got a golden spatula at the top of that. I don't know how we're going to get to the top of that, though. What do you want me to do to get up? Can we. I mean, we aren't. Can we just climb it? I wasn't expecting that to work, but look at that, fellas. We're up to 11. Not too shabby. This is this is back at the front as well. I don't really know how we're supposed to advance. Now, this looks interesting. It looks like we might have a bit of a separate direction to go out here. I love What's up, buddy? Present. I feel like a new spot. Got him. Got one of Patrick's socks out here. That's six of them. We need ten to be able to trade for a golden spatula, right? So we're gonna have to check that out eventually. That doesn't help us advance, though. I'm a little... A little confused and concerned as to how we're gonna advance. We need to get more of these... We need to get more of these, uh... Oh! That's how we do it. Okay. Need to get more of these wheels is what I was trying to say. Nice. There it is. All right. So now we can hop back up here. Let's take this guy down. Let's take this guy down. Sounds like we've got another thing shooting at us we're going to have to watch out for. We've got guys that get us up there. Ooh. Where's this thing shooting This from? door is locked from the inside. Who would do such a thing? I don't know. How do we take care of it? Gonna have to get inside there somehow. Looks like we might want to go up here. Okay. So these things are moving. We gotta time this right. There it is. Oh. Boy, Patrick will be glad to have Patrick's this back. Socks there. Oh, not gonna be able to make it to that. Hmm. Looks like we can go through here. Hi, Gary. Meow. Yes, thanks for noticing. I have been working out. <laughs> <laughs> Not done. Doesn't that mean... Meow. So there's an oh, exit. We've got another to golden spatula. Which leads to the lighthouse? Aha, uh -huh. there's another golden spatula. I could really use that. Meow. I mean, we are far from getting all the wheels, SpongeBob. What do you mean get Sandy to help me? <laughs> I can get through this. Meow, meow. 
Oh, that gap looks big. Okay, I'm definitely not making that jump. How is anyone going to get across there? Uh-oh, more robots. Wow. Holy Dutchman's ghost! That gap looks impossible. Okay, okay, I'll go get Sandy to help me out. That's a jump as big as Texas, baby. Where's Sandy at? How do we get Sandy? I'm assuming we just keep on going and we'll we'll see see her eventually, I hope. So her ability is obviously going to be something related to... Uh, this is going to be a nice combo. It's going to be something related to, to making big jumps. It's going to give us a new, new ability. We need to get up to this guy. Nice. Four out of 11. Okay. Oh, oh. Get out of here, fam. 2100 to open this up. I mean, that's... That's a little steep, but... Maybe we want it. That's gonna get us out of here, though. So we obviously don't want to get out of here yet. I do want to... Oh, shoot. That's my bad. I do want to... Go get the, the yeah, zombie like spawner breeze. out here. I didn't notice this the first time through, but there is a zombie spawner. Over yonder. So we can take him out. Let's go ahead and activate that. See if that gets us a chain reaction. That's what I'm talking about. Exactly what we're looking for. And now let's get to our main objective. Looks like we've got a bus stop here. And we're going to be be able to swap over to Sandy. Sandy Cheeks! See what you're up to, girls. See what you got. Jump to the top of these steps. Sandy can glide across the gap to the next rooftop by double jumping and holding X afterwards. Could be a flying squirrel, huh? All right. Wow! That's impressive, girl. That is what I'm talking about. It's got our our helicopter lasso here, dude. This is this game is actually really good. Sandy can do a chop attack by pressing square. If you chop all in the air, you will perform a karate kick. Okay, so we've got a chop attack and we've got a karate kick. Oh yeah, she is trained in the the martial arts. That's for sure. Sandy can lasso the object by pressing circle. Go ahead and bring him in. Just like so. That last one there. And now we're gonna head over here. See what this one says. Sandy can swing from a swing hook by pressing circle. Interesting. Ah, oh, you gotta hold it though. Okay. And then you're gonna have to release at the right time. Dude, she's got movement. R lasso a robot by pressing circle. Gotta wait till he gets a little bit closer. Bada bing, bada boom. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Ooh. Looks like we got a spawner up above us, so we're gonna have to go take that out. She go! All right, where do we want to head to next? Ah! Nicely done! By the squirrel in the spacesuit. Should be a oh. Oh my We got up there! Dude, I, <laughs> I tried to hold circle, you gotta hold X. Alright, it says our exit is this way. Travel to the rooftops. I'm down. Let's keep it going. I I almost almost messed that one up, but we were able to make it. I love it. Dude, this game is actually low-key pretty pretty entertaining. Like I'm I'm having hey, a good time What's with this. Shaking? Sandy, boy, am I glad to see you. I need your help. My TV reception has been terrible lately. I need to have someone replace my old antenna with this shiny new one. Yes, sir. That there antenna is shinier than a $3 bill. <laughs> well, why don't you replace it yourself? I'm not really much of a jumper. So what's jumping got to do with it? Because the old antenna is up there. Ooh. And there's a golden spatula. That's taller than a glass of Texas iced tea. The robots have blocked off that building, and I can't do all those fancy moves you and SpongeBob do to get across these gaps. All I can do is flex! Wanna see? Yeah, great. Uh, so what are you gonna do with the old antenna? Oh, that? It's yours if you replace it with a new one. Well, I have been getting bad TV reception in the tree dome. Okay, Larry, you got a deal. Looks like we may want to go this way next. Oh, yeah. Sandy can handle business. What's going on with the... Ooh. Oh. We got flying robots now. Oh. 
That was not very nice of you, Mr. Robot. I might have to, uh, I might have to lasso you for that. Whoa. Gotta watch out, okay. Oh my gosh! We're fine. It's it's no big deal. You know, we just fell fell to our death from the rooftops. No uh no big deal at all. But we we made it. We're good. Okay. Let's go ahead and try to Can we get up here? What the heck? There it is. Alright. I like the lassoing robots. That makes it a little bit a little bit easier. We've got a new <sighs> Gotta watch out for that. Hit him with the karate. The karate kid. Come on. Blow up, blow up, blow up, blow up, blow up. Outplayed. There's another one. All right, there's five out of 11 there. Looks like this thing is gonna act as a little bridge for us. Gotta be careful, it is uh, It is a little bit sketchy. Dude, Sandy's a beast. Took okay. a little damage there, but we're That's fine. Better. Someone better make good use of all these. Um, Can we step on these TVs is my question. Are these like flower pot things? Kind of. I just don't really know. Oh, we've got these. Okay, what am I doing? I didn't even see those at first. I'm getting dizzy just yeah, running. she's she's a beast because she's Claps for messing with Texas. She's got so many quick quick attacks. SpongeBob and Patrick's attacks are a little bit slower, but she she can quickly quickly get it out there. Use our shiny objects here. Hit that, see what happens. Ooh. I mean, don't mind if I do. Gotta see where this leads. It's no easy task. Come on. Come on. Where's it leading us? Looks like we're gonna be able to get a golden spatula! Holla! That took us all the way back to the start though. Do we, I mean, we we did get a couple of boxes. Do we have a, a good box that we can travel to here? To this, oh, this took us back to the spot. Let's go, okay. Which way, I think we were going this way, right? This way was the, the correct way. Let's go ahead and helicopter on over here. Take those guys out. He's down. Should be able to come across this way. Watch out. Knock him right off. That's what I'm talking about, dude. She's so good. Okay. Uh, hold on. Give me a second. We're gonna be able to be able to come on back. Let's pick that up, and we can go on back, and we can hit these guys. Do you guys? Can we? I don't know that we're gonna be able to helicopter over there. I think we might. Might need to get a little bit higher. Ooh. So we've got lots of bridges there. Get across here. Looks like we're gonna be able to swing that way. We can go ahead and Good take care of those though. Nicely done. Just gotta keep Keep trying to make our way forward. Beautiful. Take that down. Oh. Okay. All right. Can't believe I'm wearing SpongeBob's underwear. Well, I guess I jumped right into that one. I don't even know where we're at. Was there stuff down there that we should have uh, we should have been grabbing? Uh, I mean, we've got some rocks. No, it looks like we're good. Okay. Let's keep on going. Got a new, a new guy here. Grab him, take him out. Didn't get us that time. So now we're gonna want to go to that. We're gonna want to jump across. Let's let it come back down first. I'm really hoping we haven't missed any golden steering wheels here because I feel like if we miss one, it's gonna be a pain in the butt to try to figure out where to go back. See if we can get to this. Got to be careful here. Got another golden steering wheel. We missed a green one back there, but I'm all right with that. Let's get to this. Get to this. Smooth, Trev. Let's go. Nope. What the heck? I thought 
thought we hit him twice. What the heck? How many times I gotta hit you? Let's go ahead and squeeze that. Take those guys down. Got a new we pair of underwear. See if we can hit these guys from a distance so we don't have to worry about them. Spotting more of them. Nicely done, Sandy. Clapping them cheeks, baby. Woo. Got that down. See if we can grab... Oh, shoot. I don't know how we, we could have done that and gotten all of them. Nothing over there. We're good. Slide down. Oh, okay. Well, I suppose it'll make Patrick happy. I was I was not ready for that. But I appreciate it. Okay, so we're we're back here. Oh, uh, we can we can lasso these guys from a distance. That's nice. The shot guys, they can't stay away from us. There we go. All right, so we're gonna need to slide down this and a helicopter over. Nice. Okay. Looks like we can helicopter into a swing into another helicopter here. Let's go ahead and grab either one of these guys. Should Someone take them better all make down. good use of all these. Gotta be careful here. Lasso them. We got a spatula over yonder. We got a bus station because we're gonna need the uh, the good old sponge back for a ground and pound. Dude, this is getting intense. I'm sweating. Whew. We're really starting to get up there. Sometimes pushing a simple button is the most satisfying. Push, 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 push. Says that every time. Alright, so we got that there. Oh, wait. I, I did figure out how we can can get these guys. You gotta sneak up on them. Oh, sparkly. If you walk too fast, you're not gonna be able to get it. But if you go really slow and you, you tiptoe, then you're good to go. I love opening presents. Alright, got all these guys. Now, where do we go next? Can we go in here? Up to the lighthouse. Here we go. I really hope we didn't miss any of those... Those things, ooh, are you ready, kids? Aye, aye, Captain. Ready, set. I can't hear you. Aye, aye, Captain. Ooh. I feel like a new sponge. You just met the sponginator. What the fudge? Okay, we're fine. We're gonna be just fine. Okay, that's not good. Fresh like a spring breeze. He's down. He go. Every time we drop, it's adding more, more stone guys and and less room for us to do our thing. Woo. So we gotta, we gotta kill all these guys each time, and then it drops us down. Okay, now we're down to the next one. Somehow destroy I don't this think right away. Hand. Take that down. Really, that's the biggest thing. We just gotta take it down right away. Uh, this is a problem. This is a problem. This is a problem. Take that down. Okay, this is not good. He go. Take that guy down. All those guys are down. Gotta hit this guy twice. Whew. Okay. Let me grab a, I feel like a, new spot. a pair of underwear here. Okay. Oh, oh, it respawn. Oh, there are two of them? I, I could have sworn I already got this. Maybe there were two of them. Down. Down. We've got a golden spatula and a, a, a steering wheel in each one of these. How do I get it? How do I stop this? Ah, we got it. Okay. Golden Spatch is ours. That's going to bring us up to 15. And then we're going to go over to the other side. We're going to get that extra wheel. Let me go ahead and grab those pantalones as well. Like a spring breeze. Looks like that's going to be our way out. I mean... I'll, I'll take an L on that for that many... That many shiny parts. Up to 8,200. We do have to go like back and... and Trade with Mr. Krabs when we get back to our house, but it looks like looks like that's what we want there. That's gonna send us up. Alright. 
Gotta get up out of this lighthouse. Woo! Boy, Patrick will be glad Got a stanky sock at the top. And we're good to go. Where are we at for, for wheels? The thing is, is we'd have to go all the way back through all of that and try to find the one that we, we missed out on. We're at 8 out of 11, dude. I mean, we're not... I don't think we're done yet. Or are we done? I feel like... I mean, going forward, I don't see a lot of options for us to keep going. Um... Have, have we died? I mean, let me let me check this. We can see the details. So we got six out of nine stocks. We got, uh, I mean, we got we got most of the spatulas here. We have five out of eight. We need three more wheels to be able to get the sixth one, and then there's two more that we don't know where they are. I mean, to be honest, I feel like we're we're not in a bad spot. So I came all the way back down. We're we're back in the the like main. Uh, downtown area here. I don't know if you guys remember, but we did unlock this this direction the sea needle I guess we could go check that out. Let's see. Let's see what we've got going on So this is not gonna take us back to our, our home or anything. This is just like an additional part of the um, The level shoot so we didn't miss out on a couple of uh, a couple of steering wheels I might Go back. I, I don't know. It, it's tough because you don't need every single spatula ever. I'm not trying to 100% the game, but we do need to get spatulas to be able to move forward. So it obviously helps us out to get as many as possible. It's just that was kind of a pretty big area, you know, going through those rooftops there. I don't even know what happened. I don't. Do we actually need to replace Larry's uh, antenna? Because we boy. didn't. Someone's broken the sea needle. That's horrible. The sea needle is the cradle of Crochet Corner. Yes. Yes, it is. But what's more important is that there are tiki's and shiny objects just outside the windows. Mr. Krabs, how can you think of money at a time like this? Easy. I just clear my mind. Money. 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 <laughs> now listen here, boy. You know that I'll give you golden spatulas if you bring me shiny objects. But I'm going to sweeten the deal. If you can break all the tiki's here at the Sea Needle, I'll give you a bonus golden spatula. Why would I want to break the tiki's, Mr. Krabs? Uh, because they were laughing at you and calling you funny names. What kind of funny names? Um, you know, SpongeBob butt pants. That's Good not one. very funny. Uh, no, but they said your mom was ugly. <laughs> ugly? All right, Mr. Krabs, break to my cell. You've got a deal. All right, so it looks like we've got different sections here, east... Uh, west, north, and south. Not really sure what to expect, but we're, we're gonna give it a shot here. Let's take these fools out. Gotta break the tiki's. There's a checkpoint. Oh, here's a, I mean, that's, that's a good sign. Is this just gonna open this door back to the main room? Is this where Mr. Krabs is? Yeah, that's back to where Mr. Krabs is. All right, where are the tiki's we're supposed to break? This is a, this is one of those bungee hooks. Let's give ourselves an extreme wedgie here. I think I'm starting to, starting to understand this here. I'm pretty sure these are the tiki's Whee! he's referring to. So we, I see some of these thunder tiki's. We probably don't want to touch those. We don't want to like break those, but we want them to, to blow up on their own. I'm trying to, trying to see if we can Whee! hit them. Oh, shoot. So we just touched one of the thunder tiki's right there. We just want to get close to that. We didn't want to touch that, obviously. And now we've got to figure out how to get these guys here. Oh my gosh, we're so close. These are the last two here. We just got that one. These guys are going in a circle, so you got to be smart. Ooh, I think we got them all. I mean, that hurt a bit, but I'm pretty sure we got them all. At least on the three sides. I don't know if there's if there's the fourth side that Good we need work, to do. Boy. Here's the golden spatula, like I promised. All right. So, there it is. Spatula number 16. You love to see it. Dang it. We're one wheel shy. We're at 10 out of 11. So I was looking at our progress here, and obviously we're missing the one from Miss Puff. Uh, I, it's going to be a while for us to find that wheel, so I think we might skip that for now. The last spatula, we are going to be able to get this yet. You have to come back with the cruise bubble. So we've got to learn the cruise bubble 
uh, you know, kind of like move for SpongeBob. So uh, I, I think we're done. I think we're all good to go. We can go ahead and uh, we can exit this. We can get out of here. You know, apart from missing the one wheel, I do feel like we did a pretty good, pretty good job today. We got all but one of the spatulas. Missed a couple of socks as well, but. Um, like I said, we're not necessarily going for 100%. I think overall we did uh, we did pretty good. So let's go ahead and I say we take the taxi back to Bikini Bottom, and let's let's go ahead and spin some of our points here, some of our shiny objects as well as trade in some socks. I actually I don't I don't know how many socks we have. Hopefully we have enough to talk to Patrick, but we should be able to get at least a couple more golden spatulas, and. Um, Call it, a, uh, call it a good day. Let's go talk to Mr. So, Krabs here. Do you want to trade shiny objects for a golden spatula? Yes. That's quality craftsmanship, that is. Come again. All right, so we just got one right here. It's going to bring us up to 17. And I mean, we have we had like 9,000. We're going to be able to do that so, again. Do you want to trade shiny objects for a golden spatula? He goes That's up in price every time. quality craftsmanship, that is. Come again. So that spent almost all of our, our shiny, shiny items at this point, but we're fine. Every time we load back into a new area, we get to, uh, we get to redo everything here. So let's just go ahead and take all these dudes out. We'll take these out. That's what I'm talking about. Go ahead and sneak up on these guys and we can start getting some, some shiny things back again. I could also talk to Patrick here. Uh, you lost your pants? Wow, SpongeBob, you found some. Now they're back home, safe where they belong. Here's your golden back scratcher. Nice. Spatula. I don't speak Italian. <laughs> so stupid. All right, so that's going to bring us up to 19. I would venture to say we're at a pretty good spot considering our next thing is Goo Lagoon, and we only need 10 to be able to get in there. So uh, I'm going to see you guys in our next episode. Hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you guys for being here. Drop a like if you made it all the way to the end. And uh, we'll take on Goo Lagoon in the next one. Peace out.